I'm hungry. Mommy, 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 mommy. mommy. Hey guys, welcome to my channel. My name is Jay Dharma Wangza, and today you want to know how Lele Pons grew to her massive social media following. And as much as you were confused on how she blew up, I was also confused because you guys know on this channel I always talk about Instagram growth, social media. Check it out below. I really wanted to continue the series of how they blew up since you guys seem to like it. If you're new here, welcome to Dharma Nation. Just want to say you get the daily updates every single day. Yeah, that's what daily means. On social media growth, how you can get more followers. There's a few videos that are quite popular on this channel so you guys can like and subscribe if you're so far enjoying my content because I'm seriously here for you and I care so, so much about you guys. And because I love you guys so, so much, I literally contacted her management company and we got her on the show, the freaking Jade Show. We're freaking legit here. We're freaking, freaking, freaking. Okay, okay, okay. Woo! Oh, oh, oh my God, I'm so sorry, I'm late. Oh, uh, no, do not worry. It's so Wait, good to meet you. Show oh, again? your manager didn't tell you. No. This is the, uh, the Ask Jade oh, show, oh, oh, you know, like, okay. like the Ellen show, but shittier. All right, guys. Uh, hi. Uh, welcome to the Ask. Uh, sorry, wrong show. Welcome to the Jade show. We are here with Lele Pons. Lele, tell me, you are at 23, 24 million Instagram followers, a billion Vine loops, and a couple million yeah. YouTube too, and top 30 under 30 you're the most influential person in 2007 so how did you do this how how did you do how did you get started lately i want to know no <laughs> stop it no i'm super flattered like honestly like it's great to just be here it's just so great uh yeah my name is lele uh hey guys uh what do you call dharma nation yeah what's up dharma nation it's lele pond you know the official <laughs> Lately, fun, as you can tell. Uh, honestly, I think I just started out with Vine. No, but to really be <laughs> real, I made like Vine videos like every single day. Like even if I didn't feel like it, I realized uh, slowly the audience I was growing just from posting, um, you know, just skyrocketed, and I had to just keep going. And I knew that I didn't really have much friends to begin with. I was like, there's nothing really to lose, so I really just went for it. And I went, I was just posting comedy skits, and it was more for me to be creative rather than making people, you know, laugh. But it soon became a platform where you know Vine just started pushing my content. It was great, you know, like hashtag writing the algorithm or whatever. Uh, just being the first adopters of Vine really helped because I was, you know, the first one to hit uh, a billion plays. But for real, like, uh, I think just like making friends uh, along the way also helped collaborations. You know, I'm always on like. Ground. So wait, wait, wait. So you just made Vines every single day? Yeah, yeah. So I just made Vines every day, and then I met Michelle Obama. Uh, yeah. <laughs> well, guys, I want you to know that we're gonna have a quick intermission with our guest singer JD, rapping, drop shipping, drop out her hit single. Now. Before we get into it, remember to stay tuned to the very end. We're gonna ask Lele how she can help you grow on Instagram, how to grow on social media. She's gonna give you her top tips on growing on social media. Do not miss a beat. So he was on and the next SoundCloud hit. Talk about the difference. Back from intermission, guys. Thank you so much for watching. JD, thank you so much. Guys, guys, cut it out. Cut it out for the next act. Guys, cut it out. All right. <laughs> guys, I want to know. Lele, we want to know. What is your top tips? You know, you are growing at this point where you can go in so many directions. Movie, television. You know, do you have any problems? You know, what, what's your goals or what's your problems lately? Right, right, right. So, um, honestly, like, my biggest problem, or, like, <laughs> there's just a little bit of drama. Like, I'm really not, I'm really kind. Like, honestly, super kind. Uh, I just don't know why. Like, I'm not jealous at all. Like, I have a few friends that are, like, you know, we're, like, growing together. But for some reason, they just kind of get mad at me. <laughs> Wait, didn't she, didn't you guys, like, fight or something? No, no, no. I honestly don't know what that was about. Like, I, nope. I, I don't remember that. Like, I really don't. I don't know, me and Amanda, it's just so weird. Like, suddenly she just made a video about, like, me logging into her Instagram account because I was, like, jealous and deleting stuff. Because, like, Lele, did you delete my videos? And she's like, okay, I did it. I'm like, why? <laughs> why did you do that? And then she 
said she didn't want to talk about it. Uh, I don't know about that, but really, uh, I'm moving on. Anyways, uh, you know, what's your biggest advice for people starting on social media growth and their personal brand journey? Honestly, my biggest advice for the Dharma Nation, um, if you guys aren't wanting to be like Lele Pons, I think she just really, you know, um, leads a generation of people who just took action. She was like growing up as the weird kid. Um, you guys can look at interviews and I was researching, but she really didn't have many friends. And when she was doing Vine, it was kind of looked down upon. She only got respect after she did it. So a lot of you guys are scared of Vero or whatever musically, whatever platform that's kind of cool or trendy, um, it's looked down upon because it's new. And as much as I love saying, don't care about what people think, it's really important especially when you become the first adopters that leads to tremendous success because the platform rewards the first people on it if you really understand how um, you know if Amazon Alexa is really cool and doing podcasts is great Amazon itself will reward you because being the first people they will love to push you up so more people get to know your name being the first adopters and really going for it you know it not only is good because you're the first person to learn how and you can lead a, a whole generation but the, the platform is self will award you no matter how cringe you think her content is she's definitely got something there and her fan base is crazy all right guys thank you so so much for watching this video if you'd like it i don't know if you liked it it's kind of cringe but i really went serious real quick just to let you know being the first adopters is huge go after it whatever's next just go 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 i love you guys so much oh shout out to the comment winner shout out to the comment winner Comment on this post to be featured in the next episode. If you want to be the next comment winner, comment below who you want to see next. We have a couple videos on the How They Blew Up series. You guys can link, I'll link it below, guys. If you have some time and you want to grab a snack, I will link my Rice Scum and Alexis Ren video. It's a pretty, it's a pretty cool series and I hope you guys enjoy those videos. I'll catch you guys in the next one, literally tomorrow. So subscribe and I love you so much. Mwah.